Hey guys, I hope you're all having a wonderful day today. For those of you who are returning back to my channel, welcome back. And for those of you who are new, hello, my name is Katie. I post new videos here on my channel every Tuesday, Friday, and Sunday. So be sure to hit that subscribe button down below in order to become a part of our little corner of the internet here where we talk about all sorts of fun fandom things here three times a week. So today we are going to continue a little bit into my what I got for Christmas um, little theme here. I think that this is probably the only other video that I'm going to be doing about Christmas stuff um, because I got a decent amount of pins. Um, so I'm still pretty picky about what pins I get but there were some that were just like screaming out to me that I needed. So I asked for them and I got all of them actually, I'm pretty sure, um, from John. So that was pretty exciting. Um, so we're just going to jump into it. And there's really only one um, pin set in here that does not fit the theme of the rest of the pin so I'm gonna start with the oddball out here um, I kind of alluded to it a little bit before in my other what I got for Christmas video which I will link to down below in case you did not see that that one had all sorts of collectible stuff so pops and plushes were in that one this one will just be pins but um, John did get me or no I'm sorry John's sister Michelle got me the Mickey memories plush from December um, the hollow one and then John actually got me the pins from that set as well. And they're just really pretty. The glitter on them is gorgeous. So let me take them out of the plastic and show you guys a close up in case you have not seen them yet. So then as I said, the rest of the pins that I have are kind of themed a little bit. Um, so Fantasia is one of my favorite Disney movies. I have always really liked it for some reason. I don't know. Um, I know it's not a very popular Disney movie. Um, as far as like favorites go, it's obviously a popular one. But as far as like favorites go, it's not really ever on people's lists of favorite movies. But I love Fantasia so much. I always have. Um, Oddly enough, I don't remember ever really growing up with Fantasia, like being super present in my life, but I've always loved it. So I don't know where it came from. <laughs> I don't know why. Uh, maybe just from like the parks interactions with it. I can't remember if we ever watched it in school. I did. Um, I was involved in a lot of different music things when I was in school. I was in chorus. I was in the band. So it's possible that we did. I know for a fact that we went and saw Fantasia 2000 on a field trip. Um, when I was in middle school. I do remember that, but outside of that, I don't know where my love from Fantasia came from, but I love it a lot. So I kind of lucked out because right now there's like this Fantasia resurgence happening at Box Lunch, and there were a ton of Fantasia related pins that came out. So John was very, very sweet and got me pretty much all of the ones that I actually, I think all of the ones that I wanted. I don't think that there's any that I, I um, didn't get that I wanted. Right? I think that makes sense. <laughs> um, so we'll just jump into it. So we'll start out <clears throat> with just this simple one. This is just the um, Sorcerer hat, of course, from the Sorcerer's Apprentice uh, scene in um, Fantasia. So let me bring you in close. So then sticking with the Sorcerer's Apprentice theme, we do have a little two-pack here that has Mickey in his little robe and the hat, as well as one of the mops that is, or the brooms rather, that is following him around with the buckets. I love this. I love Mickey's little face on here. He's kind of just like looking over his shoulder at the brooms. Um, it's a really cute little pin set. So then the next set that I got is from a completely different scene and all the rest of these um, from here on out are all from different parts of Fantasia. There's no more that fall into the same and this one is not cooperating with me. <laughs> but this is from the scene with the centaurs and the centaurettes. Um, it's a beautiful, beautiful scene. I love that one so much. It's not my favorite one, but it's definitely up there. My favorite one might surprise you. Actually, it probably won't. <laughs> if you know me, it probably won't surprise you. Um, but 
I love this one. I think it's so pretty. And actually, there's a couple Miss Mindy uh, little statues that have come out of. She has the blue centaur at, right? The blue centaur at, and then the black little um, Pegasus that she came out with, as well as a Sorcerer Mickey and then two little um, broomsticks. So I've been looking at those. I plan on getting those at some point. But um, for now, I just have this little five pin set <clears throat> and it is a bunch of the different little baby Pegasus lying around. They're so cute and so colorful. So we have the black one, the lilac one, the blue one, pink and yellow. And they are all just really cute in different like stages of flight. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to have a nice little Fantasia side collection happening on my board, which I am not mad about at all. The second to last one that I have is from the ballet scene, which I also love, of course. Um, this one is so cute, and it has the ostrich and the hippo ballerinas with the alligator or crocodile. I never can remember the difference between the two. Um, and he is just trying to dance with them slash trying to eat them. I would like to think that he just wants to da dance with them, but I'm pretty sure he probably wants to eat them. But it's just a really cute scene, and I love just how whimsical this one is. And, you know, the, the hippo is just so cute, and I really, really love this scene from Fantasia as well. And then the final one is from my favorite scene from Fantasia. So let's see if you are able to guess it. Did you guess Night on Bald Mountain? Because if you did, then you are correct. <laughs> we have a Chernabog pin, which is so funny because, like I said, I don't remember where my love for Fantasia came from. It may have very well just come from the parks. And like, you know, growing up and going there, I loved Spectro Magic. That was my favorite thing at Walt Disney World was Spectro Magic. And there was a lot of Fantasia representation in Spectro Magic. So I'm wondering if that's kind of where it came from and why I love Chernabog so much because the float um, in Spectro Magic with him was awesome, you know? Um, but I don't know because having recently watched Fantasia, I <laughs> I know me as a young child and I know that I would have been terrified of the night on Bald Mountain thing because it's scary, you know? He is essentially Satan and <laughs> it is a scary short, you know? It's a scary little scene. So I'm not 100% sure, sure, sure <laughs> um, where my love for him came from. I have to think that it's from Spectro Magic, but I just always remember liking him. So here we are. We have the Chernabog pin. He's really cool. He's got some fire happening. His wings are out. He is just ready to create some chaos, and he's just really cool. So those are all of the pins that I received. I think that there are some more Fantasia ones um, that are a part of this little collection at Box Lunch, but I just chose the ones that represented my favorite parts of Fantasia. So let me know if we're pin twins with anything. I'm sure that we probably will be. I'm sure there's a lot of people out there that got some of these goodies for Christmas or have had them for a while already. Let me know if Fantasia is one of your favorites and if so, which one of the um, features within it is your favorite. I, I'm curious to know that too. I know that I'm not the only one out there that loves Fantasia so much. Um, so definitely let me know <laughs> if you are one of those people. Um, and I think that that's everything that I have for you guys for today. So thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it. Thank you for hanging out with me. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.